How's it going guys, my name is Mighty Mac and welcome back to the channel. Now this video is all about Valhalla again and it's actually a really interesting one. So, mate, so before this video starts, if you guys can please smash that like button and subscribe, that would be absolutely sick. Insane. Insane. Just, just do it. Just do it. I know you want to do it. Come on. Come on. Okay. <laughs> um, anyways, let, let's begin. So Assassin's Creed Valhalla was actually revealed in The Division 2, but it was a complete coincidence. And I'm showing you this image as well uh, throughout the video uh, that, that I talk about it. But Assassin's Creed Valhalla was officially revealed this week, as we know, but it was unofficially revealed over a year ago with an Easter egg in The Division 2. And that's actually insane. Like, all these game companies uh, leave these Easter eggs out. And it, isn't it funny about the ones that we completely miss or don't even notice until, like, after? Anyways, a poster in the game featured some Assassin's Creed. Uh, uh, ic iconography, I just read that, sorry, in, in a Nordic uh, setting with a uh, Valhalla written on, out on top, and now Ubisoft says that this early specific teaser was a complete coincidence. But really, was it? Anyways, that's according to the narrative uh, director Darby McDivitt, who tells uh, Australian outlet, uh, Steve Viver, I think that's his name, that it's just the division is made in Sweden and they just wanted to uh, put some stuff in there. However, the artist was, uh, they just wanted to put in some of the uh, their Nordic culture. It had nothing to do with us, but that's 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 BS. Of course it was an Easter egg. I, well, it's, it is an Easter egg because it's actually insane. I actually find that like like mind-boggling, like literally. Even if it's not a coincidence or if it is like how would Valhalla literally come out of it? Anyways, uh, McDivitt says, I don't even think this game had a name at the time, and the studio was working under a code name at the time of the, of the Division 2's release, and once you play Valhalla, our game, McDivitt adds, you'll see that there's nothing to do with the poster that was in the Division 2. And it was a strange thing about the Division 2 posters that the figure in it appears to be holding an apple of Eden. One of the central uh, MacGuffins of the uh, whole Assassin's Creed series. Uh, the discovery of this poster prompted an industry inside a Jason uh, Shrine of uh, Kotaku to spill the beans on the upcoming Viking setting for what was uh, the codenamed Kingdom. Anyways, it's a it's literally bizarre, and like I said, if it was a coincidence or not, especially now that we know what to do and uh, about the towards. Ah, uh, fuck, the release of Assassin's Creed uh, Valhalla. Anyways, it's literally insane and mind-boggling as how things can turn out. Anyways, if you guys have literally watched up until now and have enjoyed this video, comment down poster so I know that you guys have watched until now. And if you have, that means you guys are goddamn legends. So, I just lost my voice there. Anyways, um, that's going to do it for this video. And if you guys have enjoyed, make sure you do smash that like button and subscribe. And I'll see you guys again next time. So, have a good day and bye bye